guys welcome back to my channel so in today's video we have Caitlin uh, in here and she's the one that makes coffee really good coffee actually and her IG name is Street Brew Coffee yes ma'am that's me so Caitlin are you ready for our questions yeah let's do this <laughs> all right so let's talk a, a bit about you as an entrepreneur especially a young entrepreneur I would like to know more about you like let us know more about what Caitlin does yeah for sure so um I'm Caitlin. I run Street Brew Coffee, which is a brand new social enterprise coffee company here in Toronto. I was a youth pastor here in Toronto at a church for a whole bunch of years. Oh, wow. uh, and I did a lot of outreach with the homeless. That's kind of really where uh, the heart for that came. I went away to school and for one of my senior projects, um, we had to come up with kind of like a non-profit organization that we'd want to be a part of that also gave back to the community. Kind of dreamt up Strooper Coffee for the assignment. So like love the project. Because my dad had already started like toying around with the idea of roasting our own coffee. So I was a youth pastor, went to school, uh, was going to start a doctorate. I decided that I did not want to continue in academia, at least right away. Yeah. And we started a coffee company. Did, huh? How long did you have this business, this online business? We started, my dad started roasting coffee back in like 2017. Um, I dreamed it up in 2019 uh, and we launched in October 2019. So we're just over a year old. So October 2019, wow. Yeah, it's crazy. It's been an insane year, um, but it's, it's so much fun. I never, I can't imagine doing anything other than what I'm doing right now. I just wake up every morning, one, knowing that I'm making a difference in the community is just amazing. And two, getting to connect with all our customers and um, coffee lovers out there is just the most incredible feeling in the world. I love it. <laughs> but one coffee that I really, really love has to be the Sumatra. Yes, our, our new one, and it's quickly becoming a, a really popular blend for us. Uh, you would say a bestseller so far? Yes, yeah. So, so far, our Honduran medium is our bestseller. Mm -hmm. The Sumatra is definitely sneaking up there. It, it sold out at the show this, um, at Vaughan this past weekend where I met your lovely self. <laughs> Thank you. Want to know what? is, would you think, let's say in the near future, would you think you would take a street brew coffee online to an actual store, or is it a possible thing? Are you looking into that, or you'd rather keep it online? Yeah. So uh, when we launched Street Brew Coffee, um, we did it very intentionally in terms of our business uh, model was to do shows and markets. So we were at the Royal Winter Fair, we were going to be at the Sportsman Show this year, we are going to be at the CNE this year, we were at a whole bunch of really big shows, which has been great, because that's allowed us to just go to people physically. Yeah. You don't have to come to us, we're going to show up at, at your regular events, basically. But our long-term goal is to absolutely have a coffee shop uh, with our roastery right there in the back. That employs people who are currently homeless or experiencing homelessness but don't want to be homeless anymore so oh, we're very going to be good. able to give them jobs job skills help them find apartments set up bank accounts just give them a second chance to get back on their feet and reintegrate with society so that is our long-term goal one day open up a shop that is able to do that oh i love that honestly i i uh, tr truly i'm not just saying that for the camera i really i really love that idea oh something else that i was intrigued why did you choose the color um, purple for the actual packaging? Um, yes, that's just my dad. Um, oh. That's his like, new favorite color. <laughs> now quickly become my favorite color because I see it everywhere. Uh, I was going through our Instagram this morning and I was like, I've posted a lot of purple. Yeah. Um, uh, it's just, it's a really fun color. Um, my dad loves it. So yeah, we're just, we're just going to blame my dad on that one. No intentionality, really, I don't think. <laughs> Honestly, the product speaks for itself. You don't need extra, like, packaging and whatnot. This is simple, and people are loving your coffee. Absolutely. Thank you. Yeah, that's one of our... We just recently redesigned our label. You have our new bags that have the, the big... Oh, yeah, yeah, wait. I have it, I have it, I have it. And so, um, yes, yeah. And we just wanted the focus to be on the coffee. We want you to enjoy it. We want you to smell how good it is, how fresh it is. And so that's just kind of our focus. The packaging is one thing, it's the coffee that actually matters. Yeah, no, I agree, I agree. Coffee. And what are the types of coffee that you guys are selling currently? Yeah, so we, um, our signature roast that comes from Honduras, mm -hmm. uh, we have a light roast, a medium roast, and a dark roast. Mm -hmm. The medium roast is our best seller at that one. Mm -hmm. Then we also have the Sumatran, which you mentioned earlier that you're loving 
which is awesome, which is coming from uh, Indonesia. Yeah. Then we have uh, Costa Rica coffee and uh, Brazilian coffee. And how do we order from you guys? Where can we order? I know you guys are online on Instagram, but where can we order? How do we order? Yeah, for sure. So uh, our website is probably the best way to do it. It's uh, streetbrew.ca. Uh, just head right there. We have all our coffee. We have all our merch, all that kind of good stuff. And do you guys offer delivery or how does it work? Yeah, so for sure. We offer free delivery on all two bag or more orders. All Basically all throughout the GTA. If you're in Toronto, you're in Markham, you're in Stouffville, you're in Brampton. It does not matter. We will deliver two bags or more to your house. We love having the opportunity to deliver it to your house. It's a very intentional choice on our part because it allows us to meet with you guys. Aww. Um, you guys yeah. are our community. You guys are literally our Street Brew Coffee family. And we love getting the chance to drop off coffee and just say, hey, real, even just for a few seconds when we drop off coffee. So we deliver directly to your door. All right, people who so. are watching us right now, viewers that are watching us, people that actually want and have an intention to start their own business, business as yourself, your young entrepreneur, what would you advise them? Um, I think the biggest thing is to just go after it, to just start. Um, so much of like conventional wisdom is like, oh, wait until you have like this, this, and this in order, or wait until you're older or wiser. It's like, no, if you have an idea, you have a passion for a business, you just go for it. Uh, if you have an idea, you have a passion. Don't let anyone or anything hold you back. Um, you will find the resources. You will find a way to make it work. <laughs> You guys need to check out Street Brew uh, Coffee. She's amazing. She's an amazing owner. She works with uh, her dad. And she's so positive and so bubbly. And the coffee is honestly really good. But yeah, definitely check her out. I'll leave everything in the description below for you to check out. And she does have an Instagram page as well. She does really cute short videos that are very related to coffee. So definitely check her page out. Give her a follow. And thank you, Caitlin, for being part of Be Your Own Boss episode. We love having you. We love your coffee. I will talk to you some other day. Sounds good. Thank you so much. Really appreciate it. Have a good one, Caitlin. Bye.